This recipe is for a delicious chicken and root vegetable tray bake with pomegranate molasses. Now, for the vegetables, you can use whatever root vegetables you like for this dish. I've got carrots, turnips and parsnips. We could use whatever you fancy, maybe sweet potatoes or celeriac. Just make sure they're cut into similar sized pieces so that they bake evenly. Now, to that, I'm going to add some coriander seeds. I'm just going to crush them quite lightly in a pestle and mortar. So I'm going to add a splash of oil to the veg and then scatter over the coriander and a good grinding of black pepper and then pop those into the oven for about 15 minutes. So my veg has had its time, let's take a look at it. And it's just starting to catch a little bit of colour so it's time now to add our chicken. And I've got skinless, boneless thighs. I've got six fillets. Just nestle those in amongst the veg. And it's really important that you use quite a large tin here so that everything can spread out in a single layer and catch some colour. Last one. And this is a perfect midweek supper dish because it's so simple to prepare. All we need to do now is pop that into the oven, turn the temperature down a little bit and cook it for 20 minutes. I'm just going to finish off that chicken. I'm using the pomegranate molasses here and it's got a lovely sweet, sort of sharp, tangy flavour. It's going to drizzle a little bit over each chicken piece. And then I'm going to pop that back into the oven for about five minutes until the chicken's completely cooked through. I'm just going to make a quick dressing to serve with the chicken. I've got some tahini paste here. I'm going to pop that into a large bowl. So you've got some really fabulous flavours going on with the pomegranate and the tahini. And next, I'm going to add some orange. I'm using both the zest and the juice. So just with a fine grater, I'm just going to pair the rind from the orange. Now I only need the zest for about half of the orange. So that should do. And then... Just nip that in half and squeeze the juice in. Watch out for any pips. Next, I'm going to add some finely chopped chilli and for the full ingredients list, click on the link below. And just a little bit of water. And then just whisk that dressing together until it's smooth. Once the chicken and vegetables are ready, scatter them with some pomegranate seeds and some torn coriander leaves and serve that lovely dressing on the side. For more recipes, don't forget to click to subscribe.